hop right into the messages collective see what's shaking for you today the warriors warrior warriors we've got the manifester you're manifesting something you're in warrior warriors mood mode rather or you could be in a mood i don't know what kind of mood you're in hopefully it is a fantastic one do we have the guardian number nine take time to become aware of and prepared for all contingencies by making your home base secure so you feel safe and protected so then we've got the initiate which is a number 18 which breaks down to a nine acknowledge what you do not know and learn with a beginner's mind so you can become accepted as an authority one day so there's something new that you're learning your home is protected make it up your protection if that's what you feel you need to do have some extra food have some extra water filters like those life-saving straw things the dream state right now is incredibly hectic a um, couple of things that i do recall from my dreams over this past few nights have been one tesla remote controls haven't been working they've been malfunctioning is one part of one dream from many nights ago not too many but a couple and then last night i dreamt of a younger masculine energy in a movie theater and he was throwing up what looked like vanilla ice cream and I didn't gag. I normally have a gag reflex if I even detect someone's going to barf. I can't handle it. But I don't know what that's about. Throwing up foamy mouth movie theater. So take what resonates. Kick rocks to the rest. If it doesn't fit, you can't acquit, right? I don't know what the hell is going on. My cards are upside down, y'all. Ah. All right, we've got five of swords, God, the highest being, desire to know, the acquisition of wisdom. We already have the initiates at the bottom of the deck, which does speak of knowledge, of acknowledging what you don't know. So there is some wisdom you have a desire, you're learning something new, you're acquiring wisdom. What are you acquiring? Wisdom. Someone's watching you, they're becoming more wise just by watching you. Seven of Pentacles teaches arts, sciences, and rhetoric, restores lost honors and dignities, takes honor and dignity from others. People are losing their honor and their dignity they didn't learn they didn't listen to spirit they didn't practice their own wisdom you are influencing others they are gaining wisdom from the words that you are speaking you could be in the public eye we've got three of pentacles here answers questions about the past present and future give dignities grants the favor of friends and foes faithful servant you have been a faithful faithful servant to the most high and so you are being granted another level of honor in your life and that is attracting like-minded souls to you that you will be working with that's been coming out quite a bit in the readings working with new people there's something going on with wisdom, education, institutions, dignitaries, dignitaries. Huh. Let's see, this is death at the bottom of the deck. God, the end of the universe, endings and rebirth influences health and longevity. Good health influence you could be an influencer practice good health you share your practices with others you're going through a rebirth you are helping others assisting other souls on their rebirth you're learning something new something is being presented to you from the higher realms perhaps in your dreams 
and it's up to you to decipher some kind of codes, deciphering the codes, angel number 121. My stomach's growling, can y'all hear that? <laughs> Five of Swords, 62, that breaks down to an eight. God, the highest being, God is the highest being. Some of you are loving God even more. You desire to know more about maybe even the cosmos and how everything is interrelated, so to speak. Five of Swords, to the card of Five of Swords. Ugh. He was a serial killer in a past life. He wants to kill you, but is fighting the urge. Okay. So you've got a distorted energy watching you. They want your knowledge. They want to acquire what you've learned on your journey. This person that had a past life that was quite volatile, wrecked a lot of mayhem, you could in this life be rounding up this energy. And they realize that now through observation, for obser through observing you. I'm doing a lot of stuttering. I don't know what's up with that. Maybe I need to drink some water. Might need to drink some water, collective. Seven of Pentacles. Systemic Demolition of America. This came out yesterday. Hancock, Twin Flame in reverse. Oh, there's been a reversal in energies. I posted something on my community page about Uranus and the energy moving backwards. So it's like loop. There's some loops. Energies are getting stuck, pulled back into loops. There's a deconstruction going on. Lost art. Oh, yeah, see. Systemic demolition of America, right? And then you've got teaches, arts, sciences, and rhetoric. Restores lost honors and dignities. Takes honor and dignity from others. Yes, so this is what's happening. Institutions that we've relied on to keep society in a balanced, if you will, um, existence have been under siege, under deconstruction. So arts and sciences are being lost, but they're also being replaced with a higher form of wisdom, knowledge. Hmm. Interesting. Telepathy is increasing. Um, people are getting around censorship using numbers and code words. Communication is changing. You might be needing to learn a new form of language, a new form of communication, numeric, numeric, numerical. Okay. What is this? Three of Pentacles. Your children love you more than you know. They are lying to your face. Aquarius, Leo, Aries. This is interesting. You've got three here, and this is clarifying three of pentacles. You could be working with an Aquarius, Leo, and Aries. We've got trophy wife at the bottom of the deck. Your children love you more than you know. You protect your children. You've protected your children. You continue to protect your children from liars. You do not allow certain energies anywhere near your home or near your children. 
And there's a very good reason for that. You understand energy, how it works. Someone is understanding how energy works through watching you. Even though the Page of Swords hasn't come out, I feel a watchful energy that could be coming from dueling forces. Hmm. Death. Why is death here? Karmic femme feels used and depleted. She brought a lie and stole the truth. So we've got lie here. We've got lies, dignity, and honor. So dignity and honor is being restored. It's being stripped from others through their, their lies. There's a lot of lying that is simply not going to be tolerated much longer. And it's going to require force. I'm not encouraging anyone to get out and whatever, but there's going to be a lot of uh, force involved. Yeah, <laughs> I'm telling you. You will rule them with an iron scepter. You will dash them to pieces like pottery. This force is coming from spirit. That this is this is it. This is a wrap for for what's been going on. It's just gonna. But this year is rough. It's the energies are really rough, and I just don't feel like that's gonna subside. Many of you are coming into. Um, balance in terms of your homes. There might be some additional preparations that you need to be working towards or on, um, but there is balance that's being restored, but the restoration of balance does not mean you're going to feel good about it. You know, it's, it's a painful process. It's the butterfly. It's the caterpillar transforming into the butterfly. It's the light coming out of the dark it's being stuck in the loop being pulled in two different directions or maybe even four or five or six the energy is just quite wonky so you just have to kind of bend bend and bear it if you will Whew. this exhausted me literally let's see Anything else? He was a serial killer in a past life. Oh, goodness. Here we go. Two of the dark cards just flipped out. Five of cups reveals secrets and increases one's intellect. Spreads destruction by fire. Spreads destruction destruction by fire we're seeing a lot of destruction by fire right now in the matrix queen of swords we already do we have queen of swords down here or no no okay queen of swords teaches geometry and measurements increases one's intelligence can transform a person into a bird birds are communication so once again, a lot of wisdom, a lot of knowledge, a lot of the past is being destroyed. A lot of what humans have relied on is being deconstructed by fire through force. Communication is changing rapidly. There's something new that you're learning that you might not quite yet be aware of, but you're also teaching and you're guiding. Hmm. Yeah. Nine of Cups. Healing preserves health, cures diseases. Preserving health. Health needs to be preserved at this time. Um, 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 amidst, amidst. <laughs> uh, anyway, 
there's restoration restoration but there's demolition so once again we've got a lot of duality that is happening and you're feeling that energy which is coming across as loopy and it's certainly somewhat impeding this reading because i can't speak clearly it's driving me nuts it could be the coffee could be the coffee not gonna lie had three cups and no food but okay Systemic Demolition of America. Ooh, this is a lot of cards, you guys. Four of Swords. Mission protects against slander and impious people. Ten of Wands. Spiritual communication influences religious men, teachers, and men of laws. What have I been saying this whole reading? This is what this is about. This is about communication. It's about learning, communicating, saving what needs to be saved, reviving old ancient custom knowledge, ways, etc. Hmm. Ten of Pentacles, inner and outer work, helps one keep their job, protects, protects against disasters. Oh, this is good. Okay, this is really, really excellent. Protects against disasters, systemic demolition of America. So every time something is being destroyed, it's being replaced with something that's much more needed. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, this is the last card. Six of Cups, motivation lifts up those who are fallen and humiliated. So a lot, a lot of fallen angels right now have been humiliated. They've lost all of their honor. They're watching you. They're trying to learn from you. They're trying to get back right with God. So you've also got a group that have contributed greatly to this deconstruction, demolition of souls, and they're trying to repent. And they're trying to repent by learning through you, through whatever, through whatever it is that you're doing, if it's not in the physical world, then in the astral. So yeah, this reading definitely isn't for everyone. Like I said, take what resonates, leave the rest. I don't even know how I'm going to title this. It's kind of an odd one, but I hope the messages find you doing spectacular. You know, if you're feeling a little crappy or under the weather or whatever, it does help to eat just a little and drink more water and take your salt baths. Sleep when you're tired. It doesn't matter what time. If you're if you're able to, and it's two in the afternoon, and you need a nap, take your nap. It these things help a lot. So yeah, I will see you soon, guys, in another video.